Hello friends, we are once again doing two videos today. Sometimes I like to disclaim that because I'm wearing the same clothes. <laughs> <laughs> just kind of like a just so you know we're doing this on the same day I can always tell when youtubers do this themselves um, I can even tell when they're doing sponsorships and they really didn't change their clothes that morning from a morning routine it was really filmed like a week before <laughs> so anyway just being fully transparent also fully transparent to my emotional breakdown in yesterday's video um, things are going very well now she understands that we're in control of her parenting <laughs> if you haven't watched that video go and check it out um, she might be released from her um, digital quarantine digital quarantine yes that's what it probably should be called um, this is we're speaking of our eight-year-old Ashley she will be released from her digital quarantine um, this afternoon after school if all goes well and right now painting rocks has been her distraction. Saving grace. Yes, it's our saving grace. They're really. adorable though, we gotta show them. Like, yeah, we will, show we'll show the them. Rocks. Some of them are very unique and very fun, um, and she'll, we'll show those. But we need to get them sprayed and sealed um, before I put them outside into our rock garden. So anyway, we are heading to Lowe's yet again. We are fixing the disposal, which is the other video that we're going to do if we actually get it fixed. Fixed. Yeah, and Jason's wearing his new manly jacket, which will be in an upcoming video. Stay tuned. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to do an Amazon, Old Navy, and like online haul um, because we've ordered a few different things online lately. As this I thought, quarantine we'd be... has got Dana ordering online way more than she should. It's just way easier than like no, trying to find stuff. Do it. Did you find that jacket in any store that wasn't two hundred? No, but you saw the jacket for two hundred dollars at the mall. That was a while ago. We oh, that's we that was by happenstance. We should have like. Where do you now like... that you know what jacket you want? Couldn't you think of any store where you could have gotten it from? Uh, we could have gone and looked. No, there's only one other store you could have looked at it. Fred Meyer, outside no, of the mall. Well, we'll yes. Look. Well, we we'll go to the mall. He doesn't know shopping. This is why I shop online because he doesn't actually know. <laughs> you don't actually we didn't know. We did try. We didn't try. No, because I don't want to. I know the stores and I know okay. that they don't have it. Crush local. Okay, he's a douche. <laughs> That's your favorite word. Do you need to come up with another word? I could, but I don't swear. <laughs> so you're saying you want to you want to swear at me all the time? Yes. <laughs> film in the dollar store because we're kind of in a hurry but we went and got some candy for Chelsea I have one more it's just on the back seat there but then we got some bags to wrap her presents in I'll show you the theme um, more of the theme of it when it when I get home this is just one of those like giant bags that you can wrap a present in I'll show you that as well and these like super silver bags to put everything in as well as these blue wrapping paper rolls. I'm not sure what blue is gonna match the balloons that I got, so I got two just in case. So Chelsea's birthday is on Sunday and uh, kind of snuck up on snuck up on me suddenly. So I kind of sat down in my closet today where, where most of her presents are and I kind of divvied everything out and realized what bags I could use for different presents. And I also have a leftover present for Ch Ashley. You'll see, <laughs> they're so cute. But I couldn't give it to Ashley for her birthday because it would give away what I'm getting Chelsea for her birthday. So they'll both get one and then there's another one for Chelsea. So um, we'll show you that. Well, Chelsea's always taking Ashley, so. Yeah, so just got one for Chelsea, an extra one for Chelsea, I should say. So this is the kit that I got. You'll see this in an Amazon haul as well. But this is the kit that I got for Chelsea's birthday. It's a bag of balloons and then it comes with like the stuff to make the a balloon arch. But I think I got the wrong colors of wrapping paper to match the balloon colors. But these 
will work really good. The green is also her favorite color. So I think it was a good call to go for the silver. There's little silver confettis in some of the balloons. Anyway, I think that will work pretty good. Maybe when we get the balloons blown up, I'll see if this color works okay. But um, I may not even need to wrap stuff. We'll just see. I'm sitting on the floor being Jason's videographer for his little dispose all the video. And uh, it looks like we got it fixed. Right, Jace? I think so. He's more invested in what he's doing right now than chatting with you guys. There you oh, go. Oh, yeah. No. I there think we go. got it fixed. Um, no more leaking out the bottom. Yeah. And I think we're good. Look right. at that. If you want to see how he fixed it, stay tuned because <laughs> it'll be in a separate video. He wanted to film it himself and I'm fine with that because it gets me an extra video and it gets you guys some extra advice on an extra me time. An extra you time. <laughs> We are gonna go and help friends tonight. They just moved to a new house, like today. We've actually, they've actually been moving stuff over to their new house all week long, but they both um, work full time. And so it's been kind of a, every night they take loads over. And I was over there last night until about 9.30 helping to do their kitchen and she got overwhelmed. And I just said, I'm, we're here to help. Like we're not busy, so they agreed to let us come over to the new house and help them unpack. He said he had a project for us, so I don't know what that is, but we're gonna go out there. It's about a half hour away, which is kind of sad that they're moving that far away from us, but we have all agreed to stay friends and make this summer a really fun summer going out to their new house because they live right on a lake. So, well not like, like view, but like lake access. So that'll be kind of fun. We're gonna head out there tonight, and I don't know who's coming. Are you gonna come with us? I don't know either. I guess we need to find out what projects we're doing, and if kids should come, or if she's leaving her kids behind at her old house. So we'll see. <laughs> so I just took a thumbnail picture for his video. Yeah, she takes a thumbnail, and then she's like, Duh, she turns it off, she's like, so should we cut your hair? <laughs> no. Okay, but yeah. wait a minute. Yeah, I, I did say that. Yeah. He asked for a haircut today, and I just yeah. noticed why he asked for a haircut. You <laughs> asked for a haircut. I know, but it's like, oh. Because then it became obvious why oh. you asked for it. So, so now it's my fault that you need a haircut. It's not your fault. It's just hilarious that it's like, all of a sudden me stop and be like, oh, so you want to take a shower? <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna cut his hair really quick and I might not do a good job this time. Well, shut, shut. <laughs> So we have spent, I don't know, a couple hours? Wait, what time is it? Here at our friend's house, helping them uh, move in a little bit. They have a little bit more to do tomorrow, but they hire movers to do the big stuff. The big, big furniture and boxes, and then their couches are getting delivered. But it is so beautiful out here. They have the most amazing lot. I can't super show you their nice, house, because it's nice. kind of in oh. privacy, but amazing backyard. Um, back deck is gonna be so fun cute, this summer. Tucked away back there. Anyway, it is far out here, but um, it took us about a half hour to get out here, wouldn't you say? Yeah. But um, it's gonna be really fun for them, and they totally deserve this. They worked so hard to get into a house. I'll go right or left? I think I go left. Left. But um, anyway, we unpacked some of her kitchen. The rest of it is still at their other house, and the movers are gonna do that tomorrow. And then we undid their food storage unit in their garage. And we have one in our garage, and I think we've shown it before, but we just have the big um, can. Is it 10 pound cans or whatever they call them? Well, I don't know. I don't know what they call them. Anyway, but got me That's excited cool. to, oh, I'll show you the lake here, and then I'll tell you about the food storage. That is so cool. Okay, go up there where you can show it a little bit. So look at this cool lake right so cool. here. Hang on. Uh, wait, 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 stop. Stop. Isn't that cool? So there's that lake right there. It smells yeah, so this good. Is super cool. Sorry, they drove um, up next to me. But um, anyway, we're so excited. They're like, we're not too far away for you to hang out with us. Oh, there it is. Just a little lake. Um, they said that they do fireworks for the 4th of July off of the lake. And it's just for the community that lives in this little neighborhood here. No one else can really have access to it. So. 
super fun. We're super excited for them. But then back to the food storage. So we have this giant like year supply of food storage thing in our own garage and they have the same thing. But ours is built for larger cans. And we've used a lot of them and then now we just don't use them very often. And we just need to like shift it down to put the ones um, that we don't, don't use very often down on the bottom. And then I'm gonna order, um, I'll have to show you another time, but I'm gonna order the little, yeah, we're gonna go get some food. Yeah, I say it's already eight o'clock. No. Um, we'll order rails to put like small cans, like soup and beans and corn and that kind of thing on it. Cause that's all we've been doing for the past hour is putting together their shelving unit like that and putting all the cans on it. And it's just, it's such a space saver instead of our shelving that we currently have all of our cans on it. Anyway, I'm very excited to try and like see if we can make that work in our garage. But what do you, I don't know what we're gonna do for dinner because we're half, hour, half hour away from food. But um, that one burger place in out here is kind of expensive. It's so expensive. It was like seventy dollars for just five of us to get a burger and fries. What are you guys hungry for? We'll figure something out here. I'll let you know. So this girl, Go food. she's so food. funny. She ate half of her food on the way home. Sorry, hun. So she ate half of her food on the way home, right, Ashley? Yeah. Okay, then come back in and we'll tell the rest. So she was telling me, she's like, Mom, they forgot my chicken nuggets. And she just got her kids' meal. And she's like, they remember the apples and the drink and the, or the girl toy, yeah. but they didn't give me nuggets. And I was like, you didn't order nuggets. <laughs> and she's like, oh yeah. I ate half the burger in the car. And, so I, and I left it. I didn't put it in there. Someone's tired. Like if we kept, kept, if we didn't ask you questions in the car, I think you would have fallen asleep. Were you pretty close to falling asleep? Yeah. So we're going to end our night here. Not an eventful day exact from what we could actually show you, especially because we filmed the disposal all video separate, but also can't show you like our friend's house and keep their privacy. But we had a great night and it's going to be fun to hang out in their backyard and have barbecues this summer. And we'll show you at the lake if we ever go to their lake and kayak and that kind of stuff. Because I can always like film that just with our kids. But so we are going to end our night. You want to say good night? Oh, and look, I give him his haircut. Here. Yeah, it looks good. Don't do that, you just turn turn sideways. All right, so show them your haircut. I did a really good job. Why are you turning your head funny? Just so they can around. see my freaking head because there you're not even showing my face. Well, you don't need to duck down. I just want to show them how good I do it. Cutting your hair. Okay, I like it, good. I like it, I like it when it's fuzzy. I know, I like it when it's fuzzy like that. And I'm glad I learned how to do it. So anyway, uh, yeah, that's yours. We got crappy fast food because we're just too tired to come home and cook. It's like almost nine o'clock. That'll be the downside to going out to their house. We'll get late, we'll get home late. But if we have good intentions and eat while we're out there, we won't come home hungry. Oh, and here's my water bottle, full of ice and water. And I left it here. Anyway, take care you guys. We will see you guys next time.